Hello Embers, welcome to the channel Final Flame here, and today I just wanted to do a bit of a deep dive into the Nahida teaser. Honestly, this teaser was really, really powerful, and uh, has basically united the player base together, was dropped on the perfect date, and also just sets up 3.2's overall Archon Quest for a really epic conclusion. So, first things first, for those of you who may not have known, this teaser was actually dropped on the designated birthday for Nahida, which is October 27th, and basically the same day I'm making this video. <laughs> so yeah, they actually decided to drop this teaser on her actual birthday, thus why the character teaser is named Nahida Happy Birthday. For those of you who already probably knew that but for those of you who didn't that was you know the reason that it was dropped on that night so anyway going back into this teaser this teaser in my opinion is hands down one of the best genshin impact teasers no is the best genshin impact teaser to drop ever but at the same time it really made us feel for this character now we already know that Nahida has had a lot of character development through the Archon quest and a lot of player players have grown to love this Archon, especially through Hoyo vs. Storytelling methods. But this teaser really upped the stakes for the 3.2 story and has really brought the player base together and now everybody seems to be ready to go up in arms and take down the academia, the sages, and are just ready to play 3.2. I mean, I literally went to my comment section after I dropped the video of my reaction to it and everybody was ready to go beat up the sages. Some people wanted 3.2 to drop right now. I went to my Discord, there was a mob forming in my general chat, it was crazy. but. That's the beauty of it. This teaser has done something that has never really been done in some cases for things that most of the player base may have wanted. And it's basically united the player base as a whole. And everybody is now looking forward to that 3.2 Archon Quest in order to finally, you know, rectify this situation and save our girl. And I think that's a beautiful thing. It's actually really powerful that Hoyoverse managed to rile up this many people with just one character teaser. It really just shows how much character development they've done for the character of Nahida and how well they've told the story of Sumeru so far, which I am going to say, Hoyoverse, good job on that one. Next up, with all of this together, I will say that Nahida's probably going to have insane cells. <laughs> like, I don't even doubt it at this point. I imagine that she is going to do very, very well. Now, I'm not saying that she's going to have the best banner sales ever, but at the same time, it would not surprise me in the least. This character has definitely worked her way into our hearts, especially after this teaser. I know so many people that were legit like, ah, man, I'm not going to get Nahida. But after watching this teaser, they're like, yo, we got to go save our girl. <laughs> Where are my people <laughs> It's crazy, but it, it's it's honestly really it's really cool to see how something can just bring so many people together, even though at the end of the day, it's not even like, you know, something that's actually happening in the real world. But that just really goes to show how powerful video games are within certain communities. You know, it's not always about the what's actually happening, but. The fact that it can just really bring people together and even sometimes make people form a giant mob in order to destroy some in-game NPCs. But hey, it is what it is. <laughs> now, I gotta say, I really like how Hoyoverse delivered this all. And for those of you who have been wondering, what are those scripts at the third dream? What have they been saying? So I went to Genshin Main's Twitter, your guide to the vat, and... I actually figured out what the scripts were saying. So just a quick run through. The Sumer script at the bottom of the screen reads as, the flower carriage Rock Nahida opened her eyes. Said she just dreamed a dream. Dreamed of the day she was born. Dreamed of the day that the sages found her. Alas, but where had Lord Ruka Devada gone to? We are all eager to meet her once again. Realizing the Lord had perished around her, they gathered. To tears they were dashed. In the end, Nahida was locked in by the devout. In the end, no one 
could Nahida reach out? So, yeah. Some powerful stuff. But basically, that third dream wasn't um, just a dream. It was a memory of the day that Nahida was found and taken to Sumeru and basically locked away. If you guys remember from the Archon Quest, Nahida has been locked away for basically 500 years. And if you remember from the you know trailer real quick for 3.2, this is going to be her first time actually walking on her own two feet outside. So looking forward to that day, 100%. But I have to say, Hoyoverse really did a good job on this one. I'm actually surprised how powerful Genshin Impact is, especially right now for a character like this. It just really goes to show that sometimes it's, you know, it's bigger than just a game. It's, it's surprising, I know, but sometimes it's bigger than just a game. And it's really cool to be able to connect with like other people who are feeling those same emotions as you are and just getting hype for a character. And I gotta say, this is probably one of the characters we're really hyped for now. It's been a minute since we've been hyped for like a character or like as a community, but it seems like everybody is planning on either getting Nahida or, you know, saving for somebody else that might be coming right after, who knows. But um, the hype for her is real. It seems a lot of people have been enjoying her story quest. And it seems like a lot of people are ready to go and save our girl at the end of the day. So other than that, though, I just found this to be an amazing teaser. I just wanted to talk on it a bit more. I know some of my thoughts were a bit jumbled. I'm not going to lie to you. I didn't really plan this out as effectively as I wanted to, especially since I wanted to get it out today being her birthday. But this will definitely be one of the teasers I feel the community remembers for a long, long time especially those of us who were here for its initial, you know, release. Like, peeps who come and join the game, like, a year or two years from now, won't understand what we felt for us being here, like, right before 3.2, for us being here for right when, you know, the story was about to get there. So, at the end of the day, I just want to say this is this was amazing by Hoyoverse. This teaser really propped up the story for 3.2 it really showed us the stakes that we're truly fighting for and i can't wait to get my hands on you know 3.2 and save our girl honestly i'm even debating if i want to summon for her before or after i do the archon quest i, I just i kind of just want to get her out of there and then summon for her. you know make sure the job is done before i get our girl in on my team <laughs> but other than that i hope you guys are looking forward to nahida let me know what your thoughts and opinions are on the teaser. Are you ready to go and destroy some sages and save our girl? Or are you planning on, you know, just chilling? And also, are you planning on getting Nahida? I know some people, while they did love the teaser, not everybody's planning to get her. And that is A-OK. -okay. As long as you're enjoying the story, that's all that matters at the end of the day. So, again, remember to, you know, just keep burning bright embers. And until next time, Latome, and if you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing or just dropping a like if you're of the same opinion. Until then, later. I'm addicted to 